see any drummers. Wanna invite everyone out to PDF Day 2020. This Saturday, 1st of February at Price Barracks in Edeville. Hey, Bomba! This Saturday, the first. That's of right, and we have Iseni drummers, and that was just a preview of what you can expect come BDF Day this Saturday. We have with us uh, uh, with us this morning three representatives from the BDF Day committee. We have Assistant Superintendent Brent Hamilton in the middle. We have Captain Ashley Main, and on the end, Captain Ivan Lucario. Good morning, Good morning. and thank. You Good morning. Good morning. Thanks for having us. And I think you should be a bit more awake. You didn't do some punta just now? <laughs> <laughs> a little shake, a little bit of shake. So, Ivan, I know you can't stop yourself, right? <laughs> All Sorry. right, so we are looking at celebrating the 42nd anniversary of the Belize Defense Force. And uh, that starts with a number of activities. So let's yes, talk about does. that. So the first thing we're going to kick off with this Friday is the passing out of our 100 plus recruits. Mm -hmm. And we're all excited for them to become new members of the Belize Defense Force. Mm -hmm. However, we are celebrating on Saturday the open day. Mm -hmm. And the team for this year is military and citizen security protecting 8867 through social diversity and cooperation. Yeah. We want the civilian populace to understand that if we work together as a team, we'll have a better Belize. Yeah. Yeah. So that's what we're working towards. There'll mm -hmm. be a lot of activities. It's a fun, filled family day. Yeah. yeah. Um, we have a lot of stuff for adults and for your kids. You know, you could, a, l a little something for everybody. Um, yeah. Some of the events are having a hot wings eating competition. You, whoever <laughs> eats 15 wings the quickest gets, you know, a prize. Um, we have a Taekwondo show by the recruits. Um, we'll be having a dog show. Um, we're also having um, a, rest, a boxing match, um, amateurs and also armed forces. So mm -hmm. BDF versus Coast Guard. Um, mm. We have six matches, so it'll be, it's, it's, we're looking forward to that. Mm -hmm. um, sports, so like football. Um, and then there's also gonna be a bikers event. So we're hoping to get a lot of people for that. Yes. Um, yeah. We'll be giving out prizes for um, best burnout, um, best customized bike, and loudest muffler. Ooh. So we have a lot 
for the day. Okay, that is gonna be quite an attention grabber, just the sounds <laughs> alone. Yeah. So Definitely. also yeah. during the day we have, everybody's used to the greasy pole, right? Oh. Uh -huh. But this year we have a greasy ramp. Okay. So it's on a 45 degree angle, it's a bit long. The person who could run up that ramp, <laughs> oh, get God. to the top, there's a big package waiting up there for you. <laughs> so you can imagine the excitement and the laughter. And that's that open on. to people who attend the event. Yeah, yeah. And anybody. Yeah. yeah. Anybody could sign up. How so steep is this ramp? Let me see. It's on a 45 degree angle okay. and it's a uh, plywood and a half. And mm -hmm. we still have the greasy pool, so yeah. there's there's <laughs> both. You can try too, yeah. try either one. Um, and there's stuff for the kids too. We're gonna have. We're gonna go back to the traditional stuff: the lime and spoon, the yeah. sock races yeah. for the kids. You know. We want the kids to come out and have some fun. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Bouncy house, trampoline, Ozzy will be Ozzy the clown. Ozzy, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. So around. face painting. So a little bit of something for everybody. The it's a family day. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And a part of it is really being able to let the family members of the soldiers kind of get some exposure to what you do and also have some fun, right? Yes. So what kind of displays will be happening? We have the Taekwondo display. We mm -hmm. have the cadets from Mile 21, the Lee's Youth Challenge program. They'll be coming out. They'll be showing, displaying their marching skills. Mm -hmm. They've been practicing very hard, and they're excited about coming out there Saturday. Yeah. But one of the things I'm quite excited about is this Hot Wings Challenge. <laughs> <laughs> I want to see who's going to... It has to be okay. Hot Hot Wings, right? Because yeah. 15 isn't that many. No, yeah, but yeah. it's very spicy. It's very hot. Okay. Are you going to be taking part in the competition? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, he's MC. <laughs> I'll be hosting, I'll be up front. Okay, <laughs> yeah. good. And of course, you know, previews of coming attraction by the ECNA drummers. Yeah. And if we go to entertainment during the day, all the entertainment, we have uh, Punta Queen, uh -huh. we have Jason Ramos, mm -hmm. we have the X band performing that day also. Mm -hmm. And one of the competition is that you learn your favorite X band song, you come up and you sing alongside the band, mm -hmm. and you can win something. Okay. Mm -hmm. So that's great for the fans, especially because now they get to show how much they, they know and follow the songs. Correct, correct. And usually you move from the fair into your dance, right? Well, when we transition, we have to remember just before we transition, there is the big ticket giveaway. Mm -hmm. This year we are raffling a land. It's 120 feet by 90 feet in the wow. Oak Ridge area through Boom Road, okay. and it's only $2 a ticket. Okay. Imagine mm -hmm. you win a property mm -hmm. for $2. Yeah, I know a lot of people who want to take part in that. Mm -hmm. Correct. Yeah. Second place is an island giveaway Yeah. for one. Third place, another island giveaway for two. Mm -hmm. Fourth place is $1,500 cash mm. on the spot. Okay. With yeah. just a $2 for ticket. For $2. So yes. we were able to get a lot of like uh, vacation packages for two or for four. Mm -hmm. um, and all the proceeds from the raffle and from BDF, they go towards our welfare fund, which is basically for scholarships for the soldiers and their families so that's why we want everybody to support because it's for a really good cause yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. i mean you guys have described a whole range of different activities yeah and you know being on the committee for a day can you talk to us a little bit about how it was organizing such a big event <laughs> uh, well it's been a couple months mm -hmm. um initially we started out with getting the donations for the raffle because that's kind of how we're funding mm -hmm. BDF Day. Mm -hmm. um, so we started with going to all the businesses and getting donations for the raffle and so that we could help support the welfare fund. And, um, and it's been a lot of, like, it's three of us here, but the committee is huge. It's, it's a lot of different There's moving a lot parts. Of people behind yeah. the scenes. Security and like someone organizing the grounds. Like, it's, it's been a lot. Selling <laughs> boots, making yeah. sure we get the entertainers. You know, there's so much going on, the wheel have to spin. Mm -hmm. It's not just the three of us, but there's a lot of people working to make this event a success. Mm -hmm. So fo following the big ticket item and giving away the raffle, we have ECNA drummers who will be there, mm -hmm. and uh, they'll be performing last during the day, and okay. they will walk us over to, to the, the night activity where the dance is gonna happen Yorome style. Uh -huh. <laughs> So the drummers will be going, singing, everybody behind them, okay. jumping up. And then we go over to where the night entertainment is going to happen. And, and at night, we have... In the same compound? Yes, yes. ma'am. Okay. We have the X-Ban, mm -hmm. we have Top Rick, we have Reckless. Mm -hmm. And you know when Reckless sure. hit the stage, it's on. That's a mm -hmm. whole lot of partying that's going to happen. And it's only $15 for a ticket in yeah. advance and 20 at the door. Yeah. But yeah. we also have Alfred, Mr. Hype, Sapal. 
and we have Frisco, the one-man army. Mm. So imagine you get all that for $15. Yeah. Giveaways all night. Now, I want to come back to some of the events, but we've we, we, we got to talk, because this is BDF day, but um, we have the Belize Police Department here as well. Yes. <laughs> so I, I, I know you're, you're a very intelligent man. You didn't get lost. So tell us about your, <laughs> tell us about your role in, in helping uh, your fellow armed force. Well, we, I feel honored, the Police Department in Kenya, you just feel honored to be part of the BDF yeah. day. This is mm -hmm. our... We have been part of the BDF there for a long while, yeah. but this year we are this the second year we are more we are more engaged in event because of our dog show. Uh, we be doing a dog display, of course, showing off our, our canine capabilities. Yeah. We have um, soldiers that is attached to the canine unit. Okay. That, that they are soldiers, and one of them is my best dog handler. Mm -hmm. So we we be show, showcasing him on that particular day. Yeah. The dog show is something near to me. This is probably my 15th dog show. Yeah. Uh, um, what I like about the BDF that they want mm. everybody to, they, they are touching everybody. Yeah. Uh, dog lovers who, who love dogs, yeah. they can come out. We'll be having a booth out there if you want to know some type of tips, safety or whatever to, uh, yeah. about your dog. We'll be there to take some of your questions. We might not be able to help you train the dog that day. <laughs> right? uh, time consuming, but we are there to give advice and so yeah. forth. The dog show, what I like, what the BDF did, like, uh, it is, they have tweaked it. We have, um, we had, like, something like eight events, and we have tweaked it probably about four. Okay. We have the best pot liquor show. So how the best pot liquor. liquor. I love right? that. Right? Yeah. So the best pot liquor, like, if you got early pot liquor, you are dressed up and bring out there. We have three wonderful judges. We have a police instructor, a person from the Humane Society, and we have the vet to test the, the health of the dog, the uh -huh. attitude, if it does... How you prongs and how you walk <laughs> on. And, and, and we are looking for all these these areas, right? Then we have smallest dog, big dog. When we say smallest dog, we know you're bringing a puppy. You have to be a, you have to bring an adult it dog. Have to be full a, grown. Adult dog. At least so a year old. Yeah, at least a year yeah. old. And so we're going to look at that, and then we're going to have um, what we have the dog with the best tricks. Mm -hmm. Best so tricks. So if you can throw a frisbee in the air, your dog goes out and I say, hey, you got to tell the judge, look here. What kind what? of tricks you've seen over the years? The best trick I have seen over the year is uh, um, the the guy chop like two frisbee uh -huh. and that gets two of them in the air. Wow! Uh, gets, I don't know how, how that happened, but yeah. I guess that, that's a, that's the dog talent. Yeah, they recruit him yeah, into the it, canine he, unit. <laughs> yeah, so yeah. He, he bites it and then he goes and he let let go that next one and before the next one drop. He gets the other frisbee. Oh my but he, gosh! From my training experience, it was a time. Okay. It is a time. Like he chop one, and then he let the dog bite, and then yeah. and then while that one up, he chose the next one, and I could have navigated ah. what he did, right? Uh, the BDF is is beautiful because for me, in in the World War II, uh, dogs has always been a part of the military That's right. to escort yeah. prisoners to to the holding area. And so seeing them cooperating the the the, the canine or, the, or the animals is also a part of part of their um, yeah. uh, DNA. Yeah. So we, I'm excited. We we're asking for good behavior dogs. So if your dog <laughs> comes to the dog show and your dog will bite up everybody, we know what not to, not today, not that day, day <laughs> right? So we will ask that your dog is being well. Um, well, well behaved. Well yeah. behaved. Um, it's, it show starts at three o'clock. The K9 unit will be doing a, a demonstration yes, too. Yes, so we'll be out there. We'll be doing a demonstration. It starts at three o'clock. We ask people to come out like two thirty in the afternoon, two thirty p.m. Mm -hmm. So it's to register. We have a sponsor. So uh, our sponsor is. Um, um, Rhymers and Racinos. The BDF, of course, they are giving a price. I said to them. Just with the, with the award the dog, but how we now award the handle at all? Right? <laughs> so we are, we are, we are asking people. The dog did work, you know. We are asking, we are asking people that they are bringing out the dogs, don't bring out a small child. Yeah. I, I have seen in the past experience some people bring some big dog and then they, 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 it's a, it's a, it's yeah. a minor and then they can't take control and, yeah. and so forth. But we will have in a little arena. It will be well manned with thinking about safety because we don't want a dog to get loose and bite this one, bite that one, and mm -hmm. you know, so. We think after that. And, the, and the main event for the dog show is the best of the best. The best of the best. So the winners okay. from each of those categories get to go in one showdown and they get the biggest prize, the biggest whatever. Bet your whatever. best part, they can't win. <laughs> well, I believe the judge head, the, the, their heads are going to be hot. And, and we believe that if, if we have a tie, it, 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 we just, we, we, we'll get it wrong. I'm there, so, yeah. uh, you know, it, but it's, it's the best thing for 
So the category is once again smallest dog, dog largest dog, largest dog, dog with the best trick, dog with the best and trick, pot liquor. best pot and then liquor. In, in the intermission, um, these so there's no best dressed. N well, if if in a pot liquor you want to do more things with that so far, the judges will be going to look at okay. that. whatever makes them stand out. Whatever makes them stand out. <laughs> yeah. But in the middle of that, I think um, the, one of the sponsors says like he wants to bring up one of his uh, best dog food, and he's going to put it in a bowl. So in the intermission, if someone who Think that their dog could eat up a, eat the food first, or could eat it all finished first. It's gonna get a prize. So we're gonna put. The so they will also have a dog eating. Dog eating. Okay. Oh, okay. Right? Yeah. No man, people starve their dogs. You see? <laughs> and, and what what I also like about it, not to take away from these guys, time can only have a lot more they want to say also, yeah. is that when people come with their dogs, right? It is opportunity for me as a master canine to see what the, what are they doing. Uh, are there are there any any dog cruelty around the areas? Mm -hmm. uh, the dog are well care. It is a networking, having a vet to tell them, okay, you yeah, could start treating the dog. So it's a it's a family yeah. affair. We have a designated area yeah. uh, when they come to if they want to put their dog. We don't want the dog to be out there all day in the, in the sun. So we have a little shaded area where they can go oh, good. and put their dog. So for the dogs. I'm sure that's a big attraction for people too. Yes. Yeah. yeah. You it see, you have dogs and people flock to it. Yeah. It was a hit last year. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So get your pot liquor ready for the competition, <laughs> right? <laughs> Only in Belize. So we have a kid zone. We have sports taking That's place. Right. What I have not heard. Tell me about these drills. What are we going to see happening from the BDF? Well, <laughs> we have uh, the drill display, of course. Uh -huh. But we have the cadets from Mile 21 doing that this okay. year. Okay. From the BDF, we have the mock bottle. Mm. And, uh, That's a big attraction, right? Yes. Search yes. And what rescue. time is that? The mock bottle is at two o'clock. Okay. Mm -hmm. yeah. Just before the dog show. Okay. <laughs> They're putting back to back events. But I'm gonna go through the list of events. All so right, we open us. the gates at eight in the morning. Yeah. Uh, we start with kids' event, eating competition, drinking of um, sodas and all that stuff for the kids. We go into arm wrestling, tug and war, and then we have some stage performances. Mm -hmm. Followed by the canine display, the bike show with the loudest bikes, yeah. um, the search and rescue, the drill display by the cadets at BYC, tumblers, more stage entertainment. We have the mock battle and taekwondo. We have the boxing match, mm. of course. Yeah. We have the dog show and then later on the big raffle. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, your mock bottle also includes the skydiving? No, not this year. <laughs> not this year? <laughs> not this year. Oh, and the kids look forward to that yes. parachuting. But and then you don't have to worry about hunger, being hungry. They, these guys set up the best food courts. They have a food court. They have, they have a, a lot of food. A lot of food. Boots. Anything yeah. that you, you think that you can think about, uh -huh. it's going to be there, right? Okay. Yeah. Now, the key thing is it takes place at Price Barracks. You do have drinks on sale, and yeah. one of the things you've done to help people stay responsible is you've offered free transportation, free right? Free transportation. <laughs> tell us, tell so us about that. Transportation, every hour and the hour there's a bus coming to and from. It's going to stop at Palori, it's going to stop at Pong Yard, mm -hmm. back to Palori, and then it's going to take you up. Okay. okay. And the last one leaves at 2 a.m., I think, from after Price the, Parks after the dance. After so, the dance. So, you know, you could come anytime. <laughs> They're going to make an announcement. Bus leaving at so and so. And then because everybody runs to the bus. Are, you you got to remember these guys are strict. Uh -huh. And if they say get on the bus at 2 o'clock, they're going to clear the compound. You're not going to stay there, right? So. <laughs> what, and the bus will leave you. Yes. You're not going to believe them. And, 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 and I like what they are doing because you can go from about 9 o'clock and stay till, stay till about 3. And you could go home, be a change, recover, mm -hmm. and come back. Come back. Catch, catch the bus, bus again. At, again. And go and go to the and it's free and it's free. The bus yeah, it's the, bus the BDF free. bus, so we 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 know is. what we're it's look, gonna be to labeled. look for. It's gonna yeah. be labeled. The, the, the drivers are, you know, special shirts and everything. So yeah. you'll you know you'll know what you're getting into. Okay. okay. All right. So what else would you say to people about why they should come out on Saturday? For me, from the from the the canning, from from looking at it, is you're giving back to your military. Yeah. Your military, the all, I, all the funds. All the money that you spend, whatever that you do that day, it goes back into these people's welfare mm -hmm. to help their soldiers. And so it is important that our country rally because I think this is the only event that they really have something to, to, to help them 
or to help the, the military in a whole. So for me, that that's a wow. Everybody probably, some people might like food, some people might want to say the bike, everybody has a deal, but for me, it's supporting them yeah. so that they, they can, you know. Yeah, and to add to that, um, I just think we encourage everyone to come out because there's a bit of something for everyone. Yeah. Um, and it's for a really good cause. So you know that your money is going to education and welfare right, on a whole. Right. So yeah. I just want to emphasize that to people. Yeah. Well, for me, it's going to be a fun, fill family day. Mm -hmm. You're going to be entertained. Mm -hmm. Bring the family out. If you can dress your kids up in camouflage, <laughs> we're going to have a booth there that they could take pictures with the soldiers. Oh. Okay. So come out. <laughs> Let's have some fun. Of course, we're going to have the kids' entertainment. We're going to do it old school style, the mm -hmm. lime and spoon, the sack race. Somebody said, but flower, I get on my foot. We have lotion for that. <laughs> <laughs> we, still, we still have the train. We still yes. The bob train is okay. there. So the kids could take a tour around the compound. Yeah. You know. Rain or shine. All right. Rain, rain yeah. Starts at 8. 30, you said? 8 in the morning. 8, eight in the morning. The first bus leaves at 8? Yes, the first so. bus leaves at 8. Maybe we could mention what's the price at the gate so people could... Oh, yeah. it's only... It's $2 to get in. Just $2. $2. A dollar for kids. And dollar for the kids. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. All We're right. We're going to have so a lot of boots out there with food. We're going to have a boot that's everything coconut. Mm -hmm. We want to make sure that Belizeans stick to Belizean style. Uh -huh. yeah. Check out the coconut boot. Uh -huh. And the people need to know where they can purchase the, the raffle tickets. Uh-huh. Um, every member of the force have tickets, or you could go to any outlet mm -hmm. and you could get tickets. Remember the grand prize, $2 and you can win Your a lot. land. Yes, yes. A land. Yeah. that's right. That's the start you need to get that house going as well. And you also have a lot of other prizes that people Give will win. Give all day, all day. Um, the actual uh, canine event Events. is at three, three. Um, you have the closing off of the fair and then you walk over, you dance over, sorry, <laughs> or you punta over, which one? Your room is style. Which one? Punta we are punta over. over, paranda over, tell me. Is <laughs> uh, and you move into the big dance. The dance is a different cost at that point. Yes. It's $15, right? In advance for, for tickets and then 20 at the door. Okay. But even so, you get $100 $200 in, of entertainment. That's yeah. mm -hmm. right. Enter we, just, we just want to also add safety and security. Yeah. That we're going to have a lot of security out there, police be there working together. We want people to know that they don't need to rush. We want them to be safe. Mm -hmm. As they enter the, the area, they'll be seeing soldiers directing them where to go. Yeah. Please be please be humble and, and work with these guys because we want everybody to, to go in and to be safe. All right. All right. Well, thank you very much, and we wish you the best of luck. And here to just tease you a bit more, we're going to close off with a performance by the Iseni Band. And uh, take it away, guys. And if you want to see them live, catch them at BDF Day on Saturday. Iseni. BDF Day is Saturday. Hey, go, Tom. 